Hey guys, Diamond C2 Vovo here, and today I am back with another video, and today I will be showcasing my simple elytra launcher. So yeah, uh, it's really simple, doesn't require a lot of materials, but yeah, it works. So yeah, anyway guys, let's get started. So yeah, let's just, uh, let's get started building it. I am going to find some new space, um, with building it, and I will be using my teleporter machine, my survival teleporter, um, mechanism. So yeah, if you guys, it, let's say if we get 20 likes on this video, then I will release a video on the survival teleporter. But yeah, anyway guys, so let's find ourselves a new area. So see, that's how it works. Uh, the teleporter works and all, so let's see. How about over here? So, let's get started. Pause the video for the list, but yeah, anyway guys, we're gonna move on. So, first for the basic um, mechanism, you are going to need to do a thing just like this. It's going to be too deep. And so, in the middle right here, you are going to put one sticky piston. You are also going to put one redstone dust on each side. Now what you're going to do is put your slime block on top of here. Put obsidian on oh, on all these four corners. Put pressure plates here. And yeah, you're pretty much all set. Here is your elytra starter. So yeah, now let's just quickly do some decoration. So Okay guys, so we have done our decorating. So yeah, I put up these cool little banners. And anyway guys, let's check if it works. Yeah, so it does work, and so off we go. So yeah, that is pretty much it for today's video. Remember, 20 likes for the teleporter machine, or 20 comments, either one. And so, yeah, so anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe for more tutorial videos like this. And anyway, guys, goodbye.